Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I want to show you how to answer this one. We can use about Lapla transformation. So we have the formula in here. This one, that is about S, capital S of S minus S of number zero in here. The next one, dy over dt, that should be about S, capital Y of S minus y zero in here the next one s that is about capital s of s and the last one that is about y of s now we have this one so we need to convert this one into this one so that should be this one this one we have like this negative number two y of h this one we have h of capital Y of H minus Y zero in here and we have capital S of H plus number four Y of H so we have the conditions so we put number one go in here and number one go in, in here Now, S of H, we can do about factorization. Negative number 1 and negative 2YS, we put on the right. So we have like this. Now, we divide both sides by h plus 1. So, for the second one, we need to transform this one into this one. Now, we put y h and y h go in here. And negative number one go to the right. So we multiply both sides by h plus number one. Now we have y h y h we can do about factorization. Number one and number one 
we can saw we divide both sides by this one for this one I need to add a bound number 1 later that we need to minus a bound number 1 so because we need to do a bound in first lapla transformation so we have the formula in here So we apply this one. Now, about B, this is about number 2. So this one, that is about the square, the square root of number 2 to the power of 2. Now, A, that is about negative number 1. So that's why you got positive number 1 in here and here. So this one we have y t and now 8 that is negative number 1 and b that is about the square root of number 2 so the next one number 2 in here that is about the square root of number 2 to the power of 2 but we have b in here so we can create about the square root of number 2 and we have 1 over the square root of number 2 so this one in here that is this one so we have negative 1 over the square root of number 2 e to the power of negative t and then we have side of the t with the square root of number 2 now let's go to this one So we divide both sides by this one. So we have Ys, that is this one. So we put this one go in here and we have two edge over this one. And we have number two plus one over H plus number one. So if we simplify this one, you got this one. So number three, that is about one plus number two. So we have H plus number one everything to the power of 2 because this is about identities in here so number 3 we can put into number 1 and number 2 1 over h plus number 1 everything to the power of 2 plus number 2 so we can use about inverse Laplace transformation in here 
so in this one we have s oh sorry s t so number one positive number one so negative eight equals to positive number one so i should be about negative number one so the next one b that is about this one so we have the square root of number two everything to the power of two now we got about e negative t cosine of t with the square root of number two the next one we have eight that is about negative number one and number two we have the square root of number two to the power of two so we need to have b and we have number two in here we can put the square root of number two and the square root of number two in here because this one multiply this one we have number two so we have positive the square root of number two e to the power of negative t side of t with the square root of number two and this is the answer for s t this is the end thank you for watching